Hi guys, this is Real Wild the Honey Badger. Uh, one of the questions I get a ton of is draw length. Draw length, draw length, draw length. How do you determine it? What are some of the points of it? What, uh, with a target, you know, with your dot in it, your scope, if you're too long, it floats around and floats and floats and floats and floats. And you can't really get it to stop because the bow is so long, it controls you now instead of you controlling the bow. When you go shorter, it'll get too short and you build up too much tension and it makes it jump and herky-jerky and it just, you can't get it to settle. So there's kind of a fine line between too long and too short is the way you reach that point that it doesn't jump, but it doesn't not float. So you just gotta kind of play and find. And the, the thing between the two, just like I said, if you're too long, you can't execute. You can't build up like tensions to get your, your release to go off and things like that. And then if you're too short, you build up too much and it, it pushes it in different directions. And so to me, those are the two, the four big things of drawing so that you can get uh, the best out of your bow. It helps make you execute the better shot and it just, all honesty, it makes you a better shooter.